you too. What's up? It's your boy 360 GZ, and yes, we are back at it again with another Barber's Gone Wild Part Six. All right, so without further ado, let's just get right into it. Look like he just peed on himself. That's cold. That's cold. Especially if he didn't know. <laughs> what are they about to make? What, what is this? The other thing is, it probably feels good though. <laughs> Dang. It probably gives them chills though. It probably feels good. It's Friday in the big what city. What would you do? And Gabriel's got a hot day. But first things first. Time for a quick stop at Danny Moe's Barbershop in Harlem for a last minute shape up. Son! Gabe, what's, what's up, baby? How, How you doing, doing, What's going on, man? Man, I just need to get my hair cut, get straight, get in and get out. Oh, man. I could I never go to a barber that hair looks like that. I'm but Gabriel sorry. didn't I make can't. an appointment. I got somebody who can definitely take care of you. All right? Who? Did if you your go? hair looking all messed That's up like right. that, the I can't only go only barber available is Ben. Dang. The white dude? Yeah. Hell no. He well, might you're not gonna have the Danny Moe uniform unless he's official. Ben is skilled, certified, and experienced. You never but know though. Just he might have balls. I ain't let him touch my hand, man. You tripping. You're at Denny Moe's barbershop in Harlem with a white barber. What would what you do? do? Yo, son. Are you okay? Yeah, What's that's good, real, man? though. I don't know. I don't know. I got waves. I don't know. I need to get this right up here taken care of. I'm I definitely will right have now. to see his like Instagram or something, right especially behind. these days. Uh, can anyone else get me? You're going to have to have an right Instagram now. and show me some proof. What's up, man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. You killed me, right? Wow, what's up, man? Come on. The white cat? What's up on man? Yeah, yeah. Man, he don't know nothing about black hair. But Daryl T. Downing takes note of the location of Ben's chair. He's sitting in the front chair. That must mean something. That's premium right there, exactly. If Denny wasn't here, would you let him cut your hair? I wait for Denny, man. Make a point. Because he's white, right? No. It don't have nothing to do with his race. You're the only one tripping in here. Right I said, I don't have time, so if it does get messed up, you know what I mean? I don't. Man, just sit in the chair, man. But Gabriel just won't sit down. You could be the guy. I could be the guy who cuts my hair. You could be the guy and you could say, man, that guy can cut some hair. You That's true. Look at that. You leave it open for somebody else to get their hair cut. You got a little hot. Yo, thank you, man. Oh, yeah. Uh, see, that's the man right there. Can't win them all. Struggle from the womb to the tomb. That's right. Damn. How you doing, brother? Damn. John Quinones. John Quinones. Yes, sir. What would you do? I'd go to Denny, because Denny is the guy I made an appointment with. I had a barber for 40 years. Right. And he got sick, and it took me a year to find Denny. Once you express your point, then it's over. There's still free choice. Four chairs. Five outside. So why disrupt the comfort of everyone? Was he right. being racist? Everybody in America is racist because we live here and we are under the influence of racism from day one. But when it comes to something as simple as getting a haircut. That's not simple. <laughs> that's you know true. Between a good haircut and a bad haircut? Uh, three weeks. <laughs> that's, that's not simple. Three weeks. So you might have to go buy three a haircut. Three weeks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not. Dwayne Wade getting a live haircut in Chicago. Oh, oh. Nah, that ain't here. He look like him, though. He's <laughs> smoking that. He get old. Nah, man. Even as a joke, this is like, this is real rough. <laughs> Combing the heck out of his hair. Man. Oh, snap. 
What is this, a tattoo? That can't be no tattoo. That can't be no tattoo. He tripping if that's a tattoo. Barbara's gone wild for real. And he got a diamond on the other side. With equal signs as, ha as sideburns. And it looked like it's flames coming up. That's just... That, that's Barbara's Gone Wild for real. At its highest level. And he's promoting it though. The, the monkey really like right here, right here, right here. <laughs> On this side. <laughs> really letting him do it. What? The the ah oh, heck no, nah. he's tripping. And the good my. Lord said, "Arise, my son, arise, <laughs> and you shall be healed." <laughs> arise, my son, arise, and you shall be healed. <laughs> Uh, oh, this is another kid just acting up in a chair. Reggie, let me see that sweat on your head. Stop running. Hey, Portland. Let's go. You gotta get alcohol down. We can get up, man. Let's go. Hey, you break the clip, we're gonna fight. Right. Put your shoes on. Get out of here. Put your shoes on. Put your shoes on. Put your shoes on. I don't see how every I don't see how just one dude in there just didn't give him a whooping. Hey! Stop fighting up, boy. Wait a minute, I'm gonna let you go. You should put your shoes on. Your shoes on, man. Say you go. Put your shoes on so you can go. Now you wanna put your shoes on. Put your shoes on. How you gonna go? You don't wanna hit me now. Wait a minute now. Put your shoes on, boy. Put your shoes on. Put your shoes on. Put your shoes on. Put your shoes on. Wait a minute! We're gonna leave the door. He's gonna open the door in just a moment. Oh, no, Pull him away from the door. Pull him away from the door. I don't want him to run outside. You would prefer him? Stop him! You know what he's gonna do. He's gonna run. You don't want him to run. Get your car. Oh, that's all right. Oh, my head. Somebody should have. Somebody should have broke the door. You don't care. Go ahead. Yeah. All right. See you later. Boy, this kid. Here. Oh, she needs a man. She needs a man. She needs a damn brain. That's what it is. She retarded, Joe. She need a brain. <laughs> oh man, that kid right like there. Hi, I'm not. I'm a barber. Oh, okay. Good to meet you. What's up, man? Hey, what's up, bro? Good to meet you, Elba. Yeah, man. I'm Barbara. Rody the Barber, man. All right. You're working. Well, you can get that special, dude. I'm your Barber, man. What's up? Elba. 
What's up, man? Good to meet you. What's your name? Block. Right. Hey, he run the block. Oh, for real? All right, I got you. Yeah, I'm putting in the shop, man. What's that, man? I don't know. They try to take all y'all customers. They ain't getting no customers, man. Come in here, L Boogie. What's his name, L Boogie? He ain't getting no customers, man. What's his name, L Boogie? L Boogie? L Boogie? You gonna let me hook you up for what? What you looking at? You ain't even got no watch. Stop playing. Let me cut you. Ah, they waiting on me. Don't even worry about it. That's basically the end of this episode, Barber's Gone Wild Part 6, alright? If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button if you guys want to see more videos like this. Make sure you let me know in the comment section. I said make sure you let me know in the comment section. That was, ugh, I was supposed to dab. Uh, let me know. Whatever. I sounded like Bone Thugs and Hermy. Hey, bye, 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 bye. Let me know in the comment section. Bye. <laughs> It's your boy 360 Jeezy, and I'm out of here. Cheat!